Hey, it's your boy, Falling back. How are you, man? We can legally go for a Not walk any together. Better. <laughs> Not any better. <laughs> Still want to kill myself. <laughs> yes, your boy forgot to do his OG intro. So, good morning, good afternoon, or good night, whatever time you're watching this video today. Today's video, I'm going to talk to you about the update on the 34 oil change in Integra and why this place charged me $1,400 for Roadworthy. All right, update on the 34. I've put the side skirts off, took the wheel off because I had to deal with Clarence. Eventually, we just come pick that up. I'm gonna take the rear bumper off as well. And the side skirts will be off. I'm gonna sell those. As it stands right now is just gonna be sitting on the stands right now. At the moment, it's pretty much just a big desk sitting on the garage now. I'm gonna take the exhaust off. Five hearts of the car while in the back. Gonna work internally on frame and just grab all those pieces off. But yeah, this is how the car is gonna live. be for now. These are the wheels that I'll be giving away. These are Koya racing rims. They were gunmetal, but are painted in black. They go for like, what, 200, 500 bucks, but part of the deal is gonna come take it. And yeah, update on the 34. Three bumper for from JSI. It's like a tight park kit. I've already found a, a buyer. It's gonna come pick it up soon. The skirts, I'm gonna sell them both for a good price. Yeah, starting to sell parts now. Then I'm gonna grab the coilers off again. Stock on back in, the exhaust, my roof wing off, weather shields. I'm gonna take the wing off. And I just wanna keep the tail lights for decorations, I don't know, something. This is what Clarence's Civic looks like with the new rims. And the new home for the side skirts and rear bumper, aka Skylar 34. Gonna quickly do the oil change in the TIG. Now, all my jack stands has been used up for the 34, or four of them. So, I just used a stock one, we'll hold that in place. And the red jack that I have on this side should be okay. Now, I'm gonna quickly do the oil change. It looks alright, amount of oil is in there. Get this all freshen up. And yeah, show where it is. So, I'm gonna get my sister now to hold the camera. Hopefully, try to get as much. Uh, surprisingly, this car uses the same type of oil the 34 did. So, I'm gonna use a 5W. 40. Full synthetic, pen right, full zinc. Yeah, the oil filter code this is Z79A. I think it takes about 3.6 litres, but if you don't know how much amount of oil you need to put in the car, best thing to do when you drain it, get those buckets that tell you how many litres of oil was in it. The best way to know. So let's get this started, it shouldn't take too long. <laughs> Alright, so first thing you need to do is take the cap off. I want to try to get, I don't know if you can see, the oil filter is actually in the back there, it's in the middle. But I'm going to take that off, but it won't be too hard. Hello. Uh, I don't think you can really see it from where that is, but that's okay. So, I got it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whoever did the oil filter in this car last, you fucking dog. So these are you tools that's going to end my life. I mean, <laughs> tools that I need to <laughs> fix it. But it is so tight still. Oh yes, spinning! Yes! Let's see if we can do it with my hand. Oh yeah, I can. Finally, what I'm gonna do is grab your bucket. Pray to the Lord that you don't get any oil on yourself. It's gonna start leaking. In five. Oh shit, it did already. <laughs> All right, we'll wait for that to drain. All right, so you see that? That is the old oil filter there. Yes, look at this unbranded cheap oil filter. So that's off. This is where oil is just here. It's a 17 millimeter and it's just all about. Oh, yes, that's done. So take this off, move the bucket. You're gonna time this, all right. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh yeah, look at that. Now he's gonna wait all the old oil to drain off. And yeah, we'll see how much oil was actually in the engine. So, all oil out already. Put the drain plug back in, tighten that up. Now for new oil filter, you just wanna lube it up, you know, like. And after that, just go straight back in. You don't even need to time it with hand tools. You just do it by hand because afterwards, the engine heats it up so it tightens itself. I can't see the hole! Just kidding, I got it. I'm literally tiny it with my hand. And as much as your hand can go, and the engine will just turn it up because it's hot oil. I'm gonna wipe all this. This oil and that should be it. This whole bucket takes eight and a half liters. I don't know if you can see. 
but there's a line here that tells you exactly how much is in it. So it's sitting on in between a four and three. It's about three and a half liters. What I'll do is so just just use one from the 34. I was meant to say leftover oil, okay? Never reuse oil. <laughs> So I'm gonna finish all of this one up, put it in there, put the old oil in this. Oh yes. Yeah buddy. Every drop counts. So the good thing about this is they actually give you a sticker when you last changed it. We'll use that sticker to know exactly when I'm gonna change it next. It's on 173, so I think I'll do the next one in 180-ish. Maybe 10,000. I should do it. I'm gonna put the lid back on. I'm gonna check. The dipstick. I miss you. I miss all the boys. This is the secondary one. It's just a one liter one. Get a first look at it and taste it. It's <laughs> my <laughs> lawn mower, guys. <laughs> one Mississippi, two Mississippi. All right. You see after that first hole there. So the second one is like the max you can go. So it's about halfway. So I think I can just about finish the bottle. Your hands in mine. I love that song. Alright, this should be done. Alright, chuck that away. Don't let us. I just uh, double check this. Chef. There you go. It's just touching the second one. So that is it. Start up the car. Hope it doesn't blow up. Oh, hey there. I didn't see you watching. It is done. Key to my depression. <laughs> Wait for the fuel pump. Can I get a um, three roast pork okay. with a uh, medium chili? Okay. Yes. Um, and a coffee. Yeah. One? yeah. Thank you. Have a good day. Now you're probably wondering why did you go and buy those three bad means Vietnamese roll? Because I am here in Winner Auto Care. I'm a Filipino uncle, so hopefully he can help. Suss me out. He also has an Integra. It's a black one right there. So he really knows what he'll be talking about for the roadworthy stuff he'll be doing. Now, this place doesn't actually do the roadworthy, so he he knows another place that does it. Get a book it in and have a chat and yeah, see how we go. The main part will probably be the SRS light. Now, I don't know why it's still on. Like, I think someone just tried to change the steering wheel one time and just the light just never turned off. But that's here. Gave him some food. I'm gonna drop it off. Hopefully, it'll be done by next week's video. But yeah, like this this place don't want to charge him fourteen hundred dollars. Like, it's just ridiculous. If it was me four years ago, I would have probably went with it. But your boy's a lot smarter than that now with a lot more experience. So, hi. Hey. That's yours for you. Thank you. I got I got a couple. Good morning. You like spicy? Yes. Where's Where is he? Where's Tito? Yeah, you too. <laughs> Hello Tito I just came to drop off the key I wanted to talk to you Where you want it? Where you want it? Where you want it? I just leave this for the day Thank you so much I want to say good morning How are you? <laughs> How's your day? It's good, it's good It's a little bit uh, busy? busy today How was he? 6 a.m. It's too early No, I wasn't I came at 8.30 <laughs> uh, All good It's not It's not your car mode? Nani, speak English I need to understand hey, The same also My car is thick oh. I say Okay, now nah young car. See, it is the same thing. Sama sama. Sama sama. Bagus, bagus. Bagus, it is good. Yeah, good, good. Uh, I'll see you. I'll see you soon. Have fun with the car. Can we swap? This one. This one? Yeah. <laughs> you like the mic, guys? Yeah, it's actually right. So many people like this one. Man, mine has lower case though. I don't care the lower case. Yeah. <laughs> for the Bye, see you hopefully for next week. <laughs> Alright, look who finally here on the video. 
The boy, the myth, the legend. <laughs> so now you can finally legally walk with someone. So we'll just take the excuse to go for a walk after he picks me up. Hey, thanks, man. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna go for a walk. It's such a beautiful day, and it's 9 a.m. on a Sunday. Stop it, bro. What do you have to say for the for the viewers? Do you miss them, man? Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Why are you ripping your car? <laughs> Thank you for making it all the way to the end of this video. So obviously, the first place I went to to get my road ready was they wanted to charge me $1,400. Which I was like, nah, no way. There's half the stuff you put there. It's not even part of road with it anyway. For some of you that don't know, this is my niece, Cassia. She only just turned one month. So, special appearance on the outro. Hopefully I get the car back and take her back next week. And I'm gonna start just taking stuff off the 34, all the smash bits, and then still decide on what I wanna do. Click that sub button below, like, comment, share this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Whoop.